and sisters, my name is Preacher Gordy George, and I have come from the parish of the Promised Land. Welcome to the first ever revival meeting at the congregation of the Stephen Talk House. As I look around this congregation, I understand why I was invited to open this revival. Praise the Lord. As I look around, I see fornicators. Oh, Lord! Testify! I see stimulating intoxicants. I see adulterers. Uh -oh. I see masturbators. <laughs> I see pornographers. I see atheists. Seven. I see surfers. <laughs> and I see encroachers. <laughs> But, my brothers and sisters, I know that your world is full of conflict, torment, and confusion. And I know that our mentor and friend, Don Sharkey, knew what to do when faced with conflict, torment, or confusion. Because Don used as his guiding light the good book. <laughs> I have this book in my hand. This good book is the East Hampton Town Code. <laughs> of you can say that you have not sinned or violated this code? How many of you have not had a midnight dick extension? Uh, I mean deck extension. How many of you had a beer at Indian Wells last summer? Or walked your dog before six o'clock? And Phil, what about that hot tub? You got your electrical safety certificate? And Larry, what about that shed? You ever hear of setbacks? How many of you have rented out your houses on Airbnb? Or used Uber? sisters, I don't blame you because I confess I too have sinned. Oh. Say yes, it ain't so. It is, it is so. Oh. Did I not stand on this very stage of the congregation of the Stephen Talk House for the last three years? with Captain Butterfield posing as musicians named Boo Bonnick and the Play. And did I not sing the Don Sharkey version of Hot Rod Lincoln? It went like this. Me and Sharkey pulled out of the talk house late one night, had Tina Pierre sprawled in the back seat <laughs> passed out like a light <laughs> all of a sudden in the flick of an eye a Connecticut Mercedes passed his by <laughs> but I confess my heart was filled with fraud and deceit to win the Mr. Amagansett pageant because could I sing? No! And could the plague 
play? No! That is not all. <laughs> I also confess that I have lust in my heart. No! No! Say it's not so! It is so. I lust after you. 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 And I lust after you. And I lust after you too. Thank you. Southern preacher. Hallelujah. Save us, Lordy George. As my torment is aroused, I did what Don would do, and I looked to the code. I looked to the East Hampton Town Code, and, and I was guided. Let me read from the code. Section 2705. Proper disposal of used lubricants. Wait, wait. What, wrong section. Section 8103. Thou shalt not have hard groins. I admit, there are times when I, my groin is hard. <laughs> Section 8101. Thou shalt not have third story erection. <laughs> I admit, I have had third story erection. code is a challenge. It can be hard. You must be firm. You must not allow your prophylactic devotion to the code to ever become flaccid. Nor appear impotent to encroachers. Now you might say, but Preacher Gordy George, Preacher what Gordy can I George, do? What can I do? do? Preacher Gordy George. You can follow the code <laughs> and you can come with me. <laughs> with me, I will take you to the promised land. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>